first question write the number write this given number in standard form how to uh, write a number in standard form we have to start from the ones place and we have to uh, group the numbers in uh, with three digits so uh, i can uh, write this uh, write it like this 004 then you have to uh, keep a small gap here then uh, this one and the last one is this this is the way you are writing this in standard form this is the billion son then million period million period thousand period unit period second question in the given figure first one name a letter which indicates a position inside the circle what are the points inside the circle o and p both are inside the circle you can uh, choose one letter then second question name a letter which indicates a position outside the circle these uh, two uh, letters x and y are outside the circle you can choose one of these letters question number 3 using each digit 7 5 9 and 4 only ones write down first one the largest possible number of four digits what is the number you can write here largest possible number uh, we have to uh, write the largest uh, digit first largest digit here is 9 9 the next one 7 5 4 so 9754 is the largest one then uh, second question write the smallest possible number we have to uh, choose the smallest uh, digit first 4 then next one 5 7 9 4 4500 7 5 4 4500 79 is the smallest possible number that we can write fourth question we are given this number divide by 100 when a uh, number with zeros at the end is uh, divided by 100 we can uh, cut off the this uh, two zeros at the end and then uh, write the answer as 158 That is the answer. Question number five. Write the time twelve midnight according to the twenty-four hour clock. We can write twelve uh, midnight as zero hours, zero minutes. Question number six. In a hall, there are thirty-two chairs in a row. How many chairs are there in five such rows? Thirty-two. Should be multiplied by five. Five times two uh, is ten. Uh, Then one is remaining. Five times three fifteen plus one is sixteen. Question number seven. We are given this to simplify. Uh, two fractions with equal denominators. So the answer gets the same denominator. We can add the two numerators. Three plus one. That is four. Four over eight. If you simplify this, uh, we can divide both numerator and denominator by four. So the answer will be one over four. Simplest answer is this. Question number eight. Express ten days in hours. We know that one day equal to twenty-four hours. So we have to multiply twenty-four by ten. Uh, then that is two hundred forty hours. Question number nine. Mark the numbers minus two and four on the number line given below. Minus two and four. Minus two. We can uh, mark the numbers by using a small dot like this. This is the way we are marking the numbers. Question number ten. Fill in the blanks using the symbol uh, greater than or less than. What is the uh, greater than number here? Uh, the whole number parts are equal. 
Then the first decimal place here 2 and here 3. So this is the largest number 0 0.32 the largest one. Question number 11. Add 7.5 and 2.37. We have to write the decimal numbers uh, like this. The decimal point should come one below the other and first decimal places one below the other like this. So we will add the two uh, decimal numbers 5 plus 3 8 then put the decimal point then 9. 9.87 is the answer. Question number 12. The following numbers are separated into two groups based on their common properties. Write a suitable uh, name for each group. Uh, you can name uh, this group as uh, multiples of 6. Another one, square numbers. Uh, these no uh, names can be given to the two groups. Question number 13. Express 245 millimeters in centimeters and millimeters. We know that 1 cm equal to 10 mm. So we can separate uh, like this. 240 mm plus 5 mm. Then 240 mm is equal to 24 cm. 5 mm. This is the answer. Question number 14. When the number of olives which Amal has rounded off to the nearest 10 is 30. Write the maximum and minimum number of olives which he has. The maximum number can be 34. Maximum can be 34 and minimum uh, can be 25. These are the numbers that we can write here. Question number 15. Express the amount 10,025 milliliters of liquid in liters and milliliters. We know that 1 liter equal to 1000 milliliters. So I can separate like this. 10,000 milliliters plus 25 milliliters. This 10,000 milliliters can be written as 10 liters. 25 milliliters. This is the answer. Question number 16. Name the solids which can be made using the given net. We can uh, name the solid as regular tetrahedron. Question number 17. Name two type of, types of quadrilateral of which all sides are equal in length. We can name the types as square and rhombus. All sides are equal in length. Question number 18. We are given this abacus. Write down the number represented by the abacus given below. What is the number? 1, uh, 2 point, 2 point, 0, then uh, here 5 digits, 0, 5. 2.05 is the decimal number. Question number 19. Write the type of each angles denoted by the letters A and B. A is an acute angle and B is an obtuse angle. Question number 20. Mother bought 5.5 of uh, 5 meter of fabric to sewer garment. If 4.75 meter was used, find the length of the remaining fabric. 5.5 meters. We can subtract 4.75 from that. I will put a 0 here. Then uh, 10 uh, minus 5 is 5. Then 4 is remaining. So uh, you can take 1 from this side. 14 uh, minus 7 is 7. Then here 0. 0.75 meters is the answer.